Yesterday I posted a video about how to edit audio in Rough Animator. And I was showing you a workaround, or what I thought was a workaround, for what to do to cut or splice your audio. But I found out in the comments today that there's actually a way to do this. So I'm going to show you how to do this and uh, take a look at it both on the Mac and on the iPad on today's episode of the Expat Animator. So real quick here, let's take a look at uh, how I learned this. I got a comment from Unmodern, and they said, uh, if you go to the place you want to split and press Modify Layer, a thing should pop up saying if you want to split the audio. So uh, that's pretty close to what I did yesterday, but I forgot that there's that uh, split the audio. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. Um, actually, what I want to do is I want to look at yesterday's video. So let me pull that up real quick here. And so here's yesterday's video. And let's just play this real quick. And you have two pieces. Now I couldn't find a tool to do that, but uh, here's a workaround. So we can just come up here to modify layer. Okay, so I'm pausing the video. And now take a look at this right here. I click on duplicate layer. But two things below it right here says split audio at current frame. And that's what Unmodern was telling me to look for. And I totally missed it. And that's what we need to do. So let me go ahead and just bring up Rough Animator real quick here. And let's check and make sure that that works. So here's the file from yesterday. So if I just move my mouse to where I want to split the audio, I got to make sure I'm on the audio layer. Because if you're not and you click on Modify Layers, you're not going to see the option. So make sure you're on the audio layer, click Modify Layers, and instead of Duplicate Layer, here it is, Split Audio at Current Frame. And I was like, how did I miss this? So anyway, you click it, and it basically does exactly what I did yesterday in my workaround. So that's the way to do it, and I should have known better, and I want to thank Unmodern for pointing that out to me. And... Um, Let's go ahead and check real quick on the iPad and make sure it works over there. So here, let me grab my iPad real quick here. Oop. Hit the home button. Let me go back into Rough Animator. Okay, let me go into my audio test project here. And so here's my audio. Let's go ahead and get to where we want to split the clip. Make sure we're on that uh, audio file. Go over here to modify layers, and sure enough, it's right here, split audio at current frame. So if I was paying attention, uh, like I should have been, I would have seen that. So there really is no need for a workaround. Uh, that's the way to split your audio. So thanks again to Unmodern. And actually, um, while, let me uh, get rid of my iPad real quick here. And let's go, I want to just show you Unmodern's channel real quick. Uh, over here on YouTube and they uh, he's got a lot of good videos here and one specifically that I think is worth watching here is this three minute animation called the end Alliance and I'm not gonna play it here because uh, it's not my channel but uh, it's definitely worth watching there's some really good animation in it and it was uh, real interesting to watch so Go give this uh, channel a uh, click here. I'm going to link it up in the comments for this video. And thanks again to Unmodern for pointing that out to me. That'll do it for today. This has been another episode of the Expat Animator. Thanks for joining me, and keep on animating. If you found today's video helpful, you might like some of my animation classes over at Skillshare.com. I'll put the link in the description below.